First responders were called here to these apartments on Saturday for an apparent cardiac arrest. When they got here, they discovered someone had died and also found that several people were hiding children in a back room. Tonight, four children less than 10 years old are in DCF custody after authorities and public officials say they were found in an apartment with six cross-dressing men, sex toys, drugs, and alcohol. Firefighters discovered them after one of those adults died at the apartment. It was obviously sickening you know, to, to hear from those that were there at the scene describing what they saw. Um, and the actions of the adults that were in the room. City Councilor at large Michael Flaherty says he spoke with the firefighters who responded to the Mary Ellen McCormick apartments and filed paperwork to make sure the state intervened with the children. According to their incident report, the apartment was in extreme unsanitary conditions. All adult parties were being uncooperative and denied having children in the apartment. Drugs, alcohol, drug paraphernalia, sex toys, etc. Uh, and so they were concerned. They had reached out to me just to make sure that it didn't get swept under the rug. The governor says DCF is now involved in investigating. Just heartbreaking, terrible situation. DCF has taken those children into its care and, and custody right now. City leaders doing a walkthrough here, now wondering how this could have happened. Counselors planning to hold a hearing with the Boston Housing Authority. The place is disgusting, uh, and uh, this is on BHA. Uh, they uh, need to be doing a better job uh, down there. Now, the Boston Housing Authority sent us a statement saying that they had received no prior complaints about the unit where this all apparently happened, and they're working with the agencies involved to take all the appropriate follow-up. We're live here in South Boston this evening. I'm Peter Iliopoulos, WCBB News Center 5.